to Bellia against Colchester on Saturday. It was your 150th appearance for town. What did that mean to you? Yeah, it's a, it's a special achievement. It's a, it shows consistency, loyalty from, from both parts, and I've been fortunate enough to, to play nearly every game since I've been here. Um, I think if it wasn't for COVID, I'd have probably reached it in under three years, which is, which is great. But yeah, it's something that I'm proud of, and, and especially proud of the journey that the club's been on in that time. I mean, to make 150 appearances across three separate leagues with two promotions and in well just over three years is yeah something I'm very proud of. Do you remember your first game? Yeah, first league game was Nunny and at home. I used to play for Nunny and as well. Uh, we beat them four 0 Um I think Angie scored a penalty, I think Thule scored two. And that sort of set us up for that season really and a really sort of dominant performance at home. I don't think I had much to do in that game to be fair, but it was a clean sheet so I'd take that. Well it's been uh, in your opinion your best performance at the time. My best individual performance would be Bromley away. Um, it was just, I think it was the second or third game of the season after we got promoted to the National League. And I think we got peppered. Um, I made quite a few saves and a few ones for the highlight reel. So I think on a personal note, that's probably the best performance that I've put in in the township. And what's been the most memorable game for you? <laughs> Easy one in it, Wembley. I think any kid dreams of, of playing at Wembley to and playing in the Football League, but uh, I think for all of the lads in there, there's a lot of lads that, that haven't played in the Football League before, who all came together in the National League North, and we've stuck together, we've stuck with that same core and gone through, and to to share a pitch with them all at Wembley, like some of your best mates, was, was a memorable achievement, and then to have been on that journey, yeah, I think, yeah, Wembley tops it all. Yeah. How does it feel to be part of, like, an integral member of the squad on the journey that we've had? Yeah, I feel 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 lucky, feel blessed to be to be a part of it. Um, I think if you'd have told us what we'd have gone on to achieve when I first met the gaffer uh, before I signed, if you'd have said, "Oh, in the next three years you'll have had two promotions and be in the football league," I don't think I'd have believed you. But but yeah, to to play your part in anything, in any walk of life, if you you're successful in your job and and you're contributing to the success of of the team, it is great. And like I said, I've been fortunate enough to play like I said, bar a few injuries pretty much every game since I've been here and and yeah, I've I've played more of my best football. Um I've only, I'm only thirty now so just coming into my prime as a keeper so I think I've got an, at least another hundred and fifty in me I think. Do you enjoy keeping the clean sheet as much as a striker score enjoy scoring a goal? Yeah, I think for, for keepers that's what you you pride yourself on, you pride yourself on how many clean sheets can you can you keep in a season and you sort of see where you are in the in the charts as well as any striker would in the in the goal scoring charts so you look and see how you compare in and and yeah so as a keeper you can't obviously celebrate a goal I mean I think I've been close a couple of times coming up for corners at the end of the games but um but no to to keep clean sheets that's obviously what well, if I'm doing that I'm doing my job and we're successful. And one away from 50 clean sheets now in what would be just over 150 appearances it's quite a good uh, record isn't it? Yeah and annoying me that I didn't get it at the weekend that would have been 50 in, in 150 but um but no to get to keep one in three, it shows you're doing something right. And like I said, to do that across three leagues with two promotions, it if we're, well, if we're not letting goals in and, and the lads are doing the business the other end, then we're going to be successful. But but yeah, it's a, a record that I'm, I'm proud of and, and hope to continue. As you said, on to the next 150. Yeah, next 150. Yeah, like I said, I think I've got, I've got at least another 150 in me and I think at least one more promotion. So, so yeah, it's exciting times. And like I said, I'm, well, part of the furniture here, I'm, Proud to be part of Harrogate Town and, and yeah, let's see where we can take this journey.